Welcome in. February 14th is a romantic tradition for many couples. We get ready about a couple months, maybe even longer than that, ordering vases, ordering flowers. But inflation may be the thorn in this year's spending. I'll give you a complimentary piece. How's that? I'm selling a lot more smaller, the smaller sized um, heart boxes as opposed to these larger ones. Despite traditionally being one of the best days for local businesses, Valentine's Day is, is our second biggest holiday. Business owners in different industries are noticing fewer pre-orders. Typically uh, in the past we have you know had to put kind of like a halt to our orders. This year we're accepting more orders than usual. So as inflation threatens to break hearts a lot of people are opting for smaller more affordable gifts. Anything in the smaller range you know the ten dollar range is which I don't have any more of this item anymore, um, is sold out. And Sacramentans are not alone. A survey from Wallet Hub shows that 46% of Americans say that inflation is impacting their Valentine's Day plans. With this in mind, business owners are hoping that those last minute shoppers make a comeback to save those sales. It's mostly men. They're always at the last minute grabbing something, so um, I think we're going to do well tomorrow. And maybe once again help some sell out of their product. There's a lot of last minute orders, um, and then we do get a lot of walk-ins, so that's why we sold out last year, not because of any pre-orders. In Sacramento, Maricela de la Cruz, KCRA 3 News. All that looks pretty good there. Well, the same survey shows that more people will be spending money on candies and greeting cards. Yes, yeah, some of the smaller yep. items, but heartfelt just the same.